Is this your car? <laughs> yeah, man. Dude, this is <laughs> sick. <laughs> this is <laughs> sick. You know who's it's the final day of prep. Yesterday, I drove that bandit truck all day, and it was a long day, y'all. I woke up, uh, let's see, 3 a.m., got on the road by 3.30 from Houston, drove all the way to Austin, then went to the airport, flew on that private jet. That was insane, and then I did, drifted that thing all the way until 10 o'clock. All right, sir. Get it. Then we flew back and then I drove back. I got home about 12.30, shower in bed by 1, 1.30. Woo! We are in the process of getting the wheels powder coated. This one, the powder coater grabbed me and said, hey, uh, we got a small problem, so I gotta fix it. Yeah, we got a little crack on the front here, right there. A little baby crack. So I'm gonna get that welded up. A couple updates that have happened. I've taken the car to go get a bash bar built for it, as well as the exhaust connected. You guys saw that, you know, I put the Nismo exhaust on, I took off the old dump pipe. And so here we are, we've got the exhaust on. It sounds way better. I'll uh, start it up here in a little bit. This bash bar came out really, really nice. It's got a nice jack point on it and it clears the bumper and everything correctly. Uh, however, we can see it's already developing a little bit of surface rust. Uh, and so I'm gonna rip it off and, and, you know, sand it and paint it and get that going. I got this wheel prepped, put a little chamfer in it to get it a little bit better penetration. I gotta wipe down with acetone. I'm gonna grab my filter here. Get all the moisture out of it. <laughs> And then I'm gonna weld it. Okay, that looks pretty good. I'm gonna go grind this smooth now. The crack is welded. Not the prettiest. Oh my God, that's hot. Ow. All right, so we're grounded back. Pretty damn good, if I do say so myself. Everything looks good. Nice straight edge here, rounded. There's a tiny little nick right there that I'm not gonna worry about because I'm out of time. Yeah, all looks pretty damn good. So quick repair, get this back to the powder coater and make them gloss white like they should have been in the first place. Today is the Blues on the Green concert in Austin, Texas. The final prep has to happen. I've got a couple little things, little details to button up and some washing to do on these two cars. First thing I did, I finally got these beautifully powder coated wheels back. These are the original wheels that came on it. They were bronze. They now look amazing and gloss white as of course they sh should all be, all wheels in the whole world. And then I mounted up some Continental Extreme Contact Sports and brand new tires that we're gonna try out on this car. These things grip like hell. And since we're gonna be just doing some street driving on this thing, I think it's a good option for, you know, a really good quality all around tire. This one is a 295-35-18 for the rear. And up front, we're gonna run a 255-35-18. So now all I gotta do is get the car out, mount these things up, wash the whole thing, put a couple stickers on it, a couple little details, some zip ties here and there, and then we'll be ready to rock. Buzz, 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 got me buzzing. Buzz, 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 buzz. Got me
This thing turned out absolutely gorgeous. I'm so proud of getting to see it. Finally, all that hard work is definitely worth it. The exhaust, awesome. Wheels, amazing. New tires, fresh, grippy. The bumper, it's huge upgrade. I hate cup bumpers, they look terrible. The, you know, wrap job obviously made it tie on together. Being able to clearance the fenders and give it that custom look is really nice. Oh man, it just really came out awesome. And I'm really, really excited to get to show the owner of this thing because uh, I think he was underestimating how much better it would look with just a couple small changes and details. So now that it's clean, I just got to wash this one. And then Derek and I are going to head up to Blues on the Green and try to stop sweating and go shake hands and kiss babies and have a good time listening to some blues and jazz and uh you know drink some cold beverages hell yeah, hell yeah. <laughs> we are made it here to blues on the green just get the cars unveiled and everything got the wraps off of them ready to go i'm showing nicole and ramsey the recent upgrades to their beautiful ride here awesome. and uh the first time he's gonna get to hear it with the new exhaust on it About this car, what are you I talking about? Yeah, man. Dude, this is <laughs> sick. <laughs> sick. Do you know who's, the <laughs> you know who's, the, who's uh, that one is? Yeah, that's uh, my buddy's car. I've been, dude, 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 yeah, that's man. Sick, bro. It's just so sick. Yeah, it's just fine. Yeah, it's on YouTube, but it's also on Netflix. I might have, I might have seen it. Before. Yeah, that's gas. Oh, yeah. Look, it looks like it's a hooligan. That's why I saw it. <laughs> It is, it's been on Hoon again a couple times and on Drift Week and That's so Dude, look, 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 look. No, Are we gonna be on YouTube? Yeah, you are now. Bro. <laughs> yeah, dude. This car is gas. Oh, oh bro, yeah. I don't got anything. Yeah, 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 you stay safe, bro. I saw you. <laughs> sure. Oh, you're dope as <laughs> How long did it take you? Oh, here you go. How long did it take you to like get up? Uh, I've been building this thing for like 10 years now. We're at the Core Culture booth. This is where we're giving away free electrolytes. Oh, look who it is! Hey. Up top. We got Mr. Sacred here doing what he does best, filming yeah. me filming. Yeah. This is some film <laughs> inception here. I know, right? <laughs> well, I'm vlogging. You're being pro with your, your whole rig here. I don't even know what I'm doing with this thing. A million times better shots than my GoPro, <laughs> but we'll, we'll, we'll be all right with that. I was just showing off the booth here. Oh, yeah? Yeah. What do they think? Uh, they probably like it. I don't know. It's gonna be on YouTube later when I edit it. Like, oh, I was like, is it live? Next year. Yeah, we're not live. No, I don't. I can't even post Instagram. I got no service. There's like a million people here, yeah. or maybe twenty or thirty thousand. We're about to like launch that. the FPV drone. Are you? Yeah. Don't hit anybody. I'm gonna try not to. There's actually like four drones flying in the air right now. I saw them. It's kind of trip me out. Try and hit one of those. Kind of trip me out a little yeah. bit, but that's sick. I'll try not to hit anybody. All right. Good. If I do, then I'll probably go to jail. It's on them. I'll probably go to jail. 
No, nah, just don't write your name on that drum. They won't figure it out. <laughs> just the dude wearing the goggles, right? Right? <laughs> right? Just don't take them off super fast. That wasn't me. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well, uh, the commercial turned out amazing. Yeah. I, I really like it. Absolutely. That was great. That so, was amazing. Good, good teamwork on that, for sure. Yeah. We gotta do another one. Yeah, we should. We do it. Hell yeah. yeah. I'm gonna launch it before the, the sun goes down. All right, do it. Give me some fresh electrolytes. Today I'm doing the cucumber melon. This is my favorite one, it's delicious. It doesn't taste super cucumbery. Uh, it's very mild, refreshing. It tastes like you're on vacation, so I like it. Yeah, you're going for it too. Is that your favorite one? Absolutely. Yeah, I like that one the best. You guys want to see under the hood? Yeah. All right, let's take a look. <laughs> it's pretty sick, right? No, that's all I can do before I get yelled at. I bet the cops will be here in about two seconds. <laughs> all right. Oh my God! Holy clean. Pretty sweet. All these pictures of Ethan. Oh my goodness. Oh it's my a cat goodness. engine. Oh. How can you not love that, right? Oh my goodness. That's insane. That's just fast. Bro, look at how much open air there is between Yeah, that's, yeah they're drift cars. Yep. Yeah, no shit. I know you spin this bitch crazy. How fast have you gone in this car? Two. <laughs> That's as fast as it'll go. I wanted to top it out once. What about the, yo, you know, I've created a bad one day. What's that? You live the life. I just want to hear. <laughs> We're hanging out at VIP now. The court culture booth here right next to the stage. It's loud. You probably can't hear me at all, but we got a great view of everything and we get free drinks, so we're having a great time. The core culture team was at Blues on the Green last week. Got a chance to film it. This is how the video turned out. Buzz, 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 got me buzzing. Buzz, 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 got me buzzing. been nothing short of a fantastic experience. 20 to 30,000 people here. You see the crowd is ridiculous and everything's been uh, going pretty smooth. So glad to say I pulled it off, had a great time. It's about time to load the cars, but not until maybe the sun goes down. I just figured I'd get the outro done now before the sun goes down and you can't see me on this GoPro. So I want to give another huge thank you to everyone at Core Culture for sponsoring this event, sponsoring me and, and bringing out the cars because they look so sick. And I just had a great time connecting with the fans and saying what's up to all you guys and sharing the love of core culture and sampling these new uh, electrolytes because they're delicious. So hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Remember to check out all the sponsors. Check out my website if you want to buy some merch and subscribe to the channel because it helps keep everything growing. And uh, we'll see you guys on the next one.